Good day everybody, my name is Dean and welcome to the Adroit and Maps SCADA online training videos. The following video is the 10th in a series of guides designed to help you the user become more familiar with our products. Today I will be showing you how to work with vector controls that are part of a vector group and also how to animate these controls. For those of you not familiar with the Adroit product, I recommend that you head on over to the Adroit website www.adroit.co.za I've already created a new blank graphic form called Pump. From my Shapes, Wizards and Examples library, I will now find a filter pump example. I will drag it and drop it onto the graphic form. This example is made up of two vector groups, the pump and the motor itself. I'm now going to open up the content view. This view will contain all objects of the selected group. In this case, the motors group. I'm not going to go along and add a new behavior to this particular vector group. The, color, the behavior I'm going to be using is color. The color behavior will be driven by my analog agent motor pump flow and the bit or slot I will be working with is the high slot. This bit will go on when my pump, my analog value goes above the high set point. When it is above the high set point it will be 1 and my color will be red. When it is below that set point it will be 0 and my color will be green. I now select the finish button and close the behavior. I will now save the graphic form. Once I've saved the graphic form I can then expand my vector group and I now have a color behavior on that group which I can edit from the content view. After saving I can now run the graphic form and my vector group all will then change color. And that's it for this video. In the next video I'll be showing you how to navigate between graphic forms. I hope you found this helpful and if you have any questions please post in the comments or visit our forum on the Android website.